A man for family looking through what's left of their home tonight. An early morning fire destroyed their condo and the one next door Monday, killing a teenage boy. Two Works View's Christy Maria shows us how much damage that fire did and what the family was able to save. It's just tragic what happened next door, but it's also scary to know that a matter of minutes could have ended things a lot differently for us. This is Tyler Coffey's home and what's left of it. It's tough seeing stuff that you've bought and accumulated for your kids and you know, finding uh, ultrasound pictures on the bedside table that are ruined or it's hard stuff. Tyler lives with his wife Ashton, their 18 month old son, and they have a baby boy on the way in April. They were days from packing up to move to Texas to be closer to family. But Monday morning, they ran out with what they could carry. I'm going down the stairs and I make it down the first half and uh, I heard the banging on the door. And I, you know, the smoke was starting to get pretty heavy. You could start to see it inside the house. And I just turned and said, said, get Sawyer and it's time to get out. Tyler's next door neighbor who escaped the flames there to warn them about the fire showing up just in time. She, uh, she my family's Tuesday, coffee finally got to see the damage in the daylight searching for the most important items left behind. One of the littlest items was the biggest thing to find. And tirelessly picking through the rubble. She always puts it on top of these plastic shelves. To locate one irreplaceable item. That was one of the top priorities of finding was that wedding ring. The family didn't have renter's insurance, so they'll have to start from scratch. But Tyler holds so, on um, to what's most important. Everything else. Stuff. can be replaced and even the things you know family heirlooms and stuff that can't are uh, just don't even compare to the value of your family in manford chris de maria two works for you